vertigo and sleep. About 40% of people over 40 will experience vertigo at least once in their lives. Even if you only experience vertigo for a few minutes, the sensation can be very unsettling. If you experience vertigo at night, it can interfere with your sleep. What is vertigo? Vertigo is a sudden onset of dizziness that may last anywhere from a few minutes or even days. It tends to be more common in women and those over age 50. How do you know if you're experiencing vertigo? Vertigo is more than slight dizziness. When you're experiencing vertigo, you feel like no matter how hard you try, you can't seem to regain your balance. You may feel like you're spinning, or a strong tilting sensation which keeps swaying you to one side. Additional symptoms that accompany vertigo can include nausea, vomiting, irregular eye movements, headache, tinnitus, and sweating. What causes vertigo? Vertigo is typically caused by an issue with the inner ear. Your inner ear is responsible for helping you stay balanced, so when something impairs its functioning, you feel unbalanced and experience vertigo as a result. Due to its association with balance, inner ear issues are known as balance disorders. Common balance disorders that have vertigo as a symptom include, benign paroxysmal positional vertigo BPPV, is a condition affecting 2% of people where small calcium deposits, also called canalets, calcium crystals, or inner ear rocks, develop in the inner ear canals. The vast majority of vertigo cases are BPPV. Meniere's disease is a condition where fluid builds up in the inner ear. The resulting pressure causes vertigo, as well as hearing loss and tinnitus. Labyrinthitis and vestibular neuritis are conditions where the inner ear becomes inflamed from a viral infection, interfering with the its communication with the brain. Vertigo and sleep. When you fall asleep and when you wake up, you tend to change the position of your head. This change in position can trigger vertigo, especially in cases of BPPV. If you experience vertigo as you're lying down to sleep, it disrupts the process, making you extremely uncomfortable and delaying your sleep. Until your vertigo goes away, it will be difficult to fall asleep. Without adequate sleep, you're likely to experience the effects of sleep deprivation the following day. Sleep deprivation, even after just one night, is much more than mere grogginess. It impairs your focus, makes you moodier, and increases your likelihood of drowsy driving. In turn, sleep deprivation can also worsen the effects of vertigo. Waking up from sleep can also trigger vertigo, in both cases of BPPV and Meniere's disease. Rising from bed changes your head position, potentially triggering BPPV. The supine position also allows fluid to build up in your ear while sleep, potentially triggering Meniere's vertigo. Scientists are also currently looking into where there may be a link between vertigo and sleep apnea, although the studies thus far are inconclusive. Vertigo is an extremely uncomfortable experience that interferes with the sufferer's quality life during both their waking and sleeping hours. Even if you experience a mild case of vertigo and it goes away on its own, it's worth visiting with your doctor. Vertigo may be a warning sign of another, more serious issue, such as low blood pressure or a brain tumor. If you start experiencing multiple, severe symptoms of vertigo, you should see a doctor immediately. Depending on the severity of your vertigo, your doctor may recommend surgery, medication, or supplements. Discover Way Heal Vertigo Safe Quickly Natural Cure for Vertigo at Home Click on the link in the description.